The Windsor Spitfires come back with their top line as well. Matthew Maggio on the wing, Jacob Millett, Brett Harrison, Jacob Holmes, Michael Redwick, the veteran D pair. And we are ready to kick off the weekend in the end. Benicio had eyes for the net there off the glove of Cranley, comes to the line. He moves it for Christopoulos, quickly over to Maggio. Maggio back for Harrison, scores! A power play goal, and the Spitfires take White. Well, some good movement up top in the offensive zone here for the Spitfires on this power play, and Harrison... Off guard, now it's Maggio, back to Dionisio. Back for Maggio. Dionisio tees this shot up, it rips wide, loose puck, scores again on the power play! Well, this one takes 53 seconds for the Spitfires to capitalize. You see the shot from up top. I expect that he would probably be up over well for sure to be 70 plus games missed. There's a goal by Caden Petrie. He'll snipe. Well, this Flint team has come ready to play the Spitfires tonight here Thursday in Windsor. As Caden Petrie comes down. Off the wall. Back for Maggio to the middle of the ice. Goal! Harrison and captain Matthew Maggio they stayed on the puck they've got three or four firebirds around them in close quarters but they were able to play off each other by every team that comes in do not give the Ontario Hockey League's leading score any time and space especially in that area of the ice and Maggio makes them pay off the post Hayes will score Spitfires open the lead to two, but the Firebirds stay close. Just said a few seconds ago before that Windsor goal that Flint has come to play tonight, and they are not phased by that goal. Abraham turns away from the pressure. We'll talk to him coming up at about three and a half minutes of gameplay. Loose in front of the net. Backhander. Pinners goes off the point. It's loose in the blue paint. Youth shows up, and they, they're putting the puck in the back of the net. They're playing well. They get some good goaltending. Two will score. Kuzman goes up over the shoulder. If been over 19 minutes here in the second without a goal. That's not to say there haven't been chances at either end. He back it over the line and takes a bump from Renwick. Sending it in on goal though was Dan Luce. Buck will score. Well, you never want to give up a goal in the last minute of a period. The Spitfires did just that with 52 seconds to go in the second. You never want to give up a goal in the first minute of a period either. Red line drops back for Harrison. Harrison moves around the first four check. Now Harrison in on goal. Harrison scores! Equalized by Brett Harrison on the power play. Works his way right through the Flint Firebird penalty killers. Goes backhand, forehand, and just slips that puck in behind Will Cranley over the blocker. Here it. Abraham steals, centers, Christopoulos pots! Quick turn, snap and fire. Side. 30 seconds left in the power play, Lombardi. Lombardi cross ice scores! Bertucci ties it at five, short. Late in the third. He's down, controls the pace, back in over the line. Curry of in behind him onto an empty wing. Heads up, Maggio to Harrison. Breakaway, overtime. The finisher, Maggio to Harrison. Back of the net, the Spitfires will take it 6-5.